I just took 37 painkillers and 15 sleeping pills. Can I have a word? No! No. He'll try to bang anything with a pussy, but it's Mr. Limp Dick when I'm around. You want war, Mr. Blogger? It's on. Hey, mommy. Ruiz, I saw that nice man, Mr. Santo, again. Nice man? I mean, he's a loan shark. You didn't borrow no money, did you? No, he helped me with my shopping. He is a real gentleman. You could learn so much from him. Stay away from him, mommy. Listen to me on this. Hey, Margo. How are you? What are you doing here? I was just... just meeting someone. A date, actually. A Hercules? It, it's a gay club. You never answered my calls. Yeah, I'm sorry. Or my emails. Yeah, I meant to. I'm just... Fucking rude. Yeah. <sighs> Look, I got a lot going on. Did you get the book I sent you? No. The flowers? No, li listen, Margo. You, you're a nice girl, and, and it was nice hooking up with you, but... It, it was over a year ago. What's time got to do with anything? It's, it was a long time ago. I mean, it's time to move on. You're pathetic. You know that? You think you're such hot shit, don't you? <laughs> no, I'm more like cold shit. But, but seriously, I just don't want to marry you. And no matter how many letters you send me, or chocolate bunnies, or skywriting my name, or naming stars after me, or whatever. It's nothing personal. <laughs> no, rejection never is personal. You know, my dad was right about you. Your dad? Look, look he probably was, okay? But if you'll excuse me, I, I gotta go. You, you can't go. <sighs> but, but I can go. You can't. I'm going to die. I just took 37 painkillers and 15 sleeping pills. There, there's the bottle. I'm going to die, and it's all your fault. Oh, yeah, but tú sí que eres loca. I'll be dead soon. Either get me to the hospital, or I'm dead. You fucking idiot. I gotta get you to a hospital, man. There's one in Easton. You're my fucking savior, Luis. I think I can feel my heart breaking, baby. No, dumbass. That's just your liver failing. <coughs> oh, this is more painful than I thought it would be. <coughs> Kiss me, baby. The only thing going near that mouth is a tube for the stomach pump. <coughs> Yourself, bitch. It would be really convenient if you died on me. I was real stupid, wasn't I? Now you're starting to understand. Thank you. Get in there. You're the doctor's problem now. Aren't you coming in? You could hold back my hair when they pump me. I see enough bulimic bitches at the club, Margo. You're on your own. I love you. Hey, Luis, what's up, man? Hey, what's up, Troy? Tony inside? No, he's not here yet. Uh, did you talk to him? Who? Tony, about me. What about you? About me working here, man. I can't do it no more. I ain't queer, and it's doing my head in. Bro, you work for a guy whose nickname since 1985 is Gay Tony. Why do you give a fuck? Because I want to be married, man. You know, I want to have a nice life. I want to pick a fence in Alderney. I want to raise kids, play ball, you know? And look at me. Bro. I don't know what to tell you, man. Desi's the man of Mason, okay? This is the job we got for you. If you don't like it, fuck off, I guess. If you do, shut the fuck up and stop being a moron. Don't be like that, man. You know me. I'm an artist. I've got songs in me. Hello? Maybe if Tony could hear me sing, yeah, thanks. I, 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 I'd yeah. be okay here. It's me. You're the fucking doorman, bro, not the cabaret. What's wrong with you? You're real tense, man. And you used to be cool. Hey, Troy! Hey, how's business? Luis, come on, let's go. Uh, pretty quiet. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> what is wrong with you people? 
Don't you know a good time when you see one? Jesus, when even the queens don't want to get wrecked, you know this city is turning into a fucking suburb! All right, Luis, get in the car. Gracie, sweetheart, in the back. Tony, can I have a word? No! No. Let's go. Take us out to Gracie's place at Alderney, will you? It's on Babbage Drive. Louise, hey babe, how are you? Hey yo, Gracie, what's up? Tone, what the fuck is it with Louise? I mean, he'll try to bang anything with a pussy, but it's Mr. Limp Dick when I'm around. I don't know, maybe it's your charming turn of phrase, or your demure, almost nun-like manner. What is up with that, Luis? Sorry, Gracie. You're my type. So can you let me be a limp dick in peace? Having a pussy is your type, Lou. Tell me what's wrong with you. There ain't nothing wrong with you. If you like really loud guidettes. Louise, fuck you. Hey, look. I stopped dealing with monster brats after Danny Lucasella tried to get her daddy to cut my balls off. Call me an asshole. But that was it for me. I know where you're coming from. The shit I got into after my night of indiscretion with Roy Zito. Oh, trying to claim I spiked this drink. Roy Z's a homo? He ain't a very good one. I never would have guessed it. Yeah, well, they don't wear a label on their head. Oh, look at this bitch behind the wheel. Tony, your extreme queeniness is starting to rub off on the employees. Look, Gordon. Oh, what are we doing out of Gracie's house? We're paying a visit. Shit. Don't we got other problems right now? Come on. Now that you mention it, there is another issue. That fucking nebbish, the Celebinator. Oh my god, I just love that guy's blog. Well, that guy's blog don't love us. What happened? He's talking shit like it's going out of fashion. So what? He thinks he's the only guy with a mouth on the fucking internet? This is something we don't need right now. Oh, no one comes to our summer party in the caraways. Chill out, bro. First of all, the summer's a long way off. And second, we shouldn't be having no party in the caraways with our financial situation. This guy could think us. Listen to him, Lou. The Celebinator is real influential. Relax, bro. We'll send them a basket. It'll be cool. It's fucking blackmail with these guys. He got left off a list somewhere, so it's our livelihoods at stake. Yo, all right. I'll check him out. What's his site? I'll send you a link. Will you drop us off and go do it now? But that means Louise won't be able to see the inside of my place. Oh, well, in that case, I'll definitely do it now. Shit, Lou. Another time. Oh, yeah, sure, babe. Some other time. Thanks, Luis. Call me when you've emailed that dreadful blogger. You want war, Mr. Blogger? It's on. How do you like his sight? Who the fuck does that guy think he is? What? You seen a picture of you and me that motherfucker put up there? Yo, that asshole's gotta be taken care of. You're meant to be the rational one here, Luis. Look, I'll see what I can do about it. I'll be in touch. 